All right, Glory, where are we off to today? I feel like some seafood. Today we're at Chacanel in Venice. Let's do it. It's Tyler. And Glory. And we are out. And about. Venice, all right. What am I going to say next? Let's go ahead and take it. Come on, let's do it. Where the sun is always shining, out and about. Who call the fight I'm fighting, out and about. I'm beginning to friends and living, out and about. about. Chuck and L, a seafood joint. I'm back with Michael. Welcome back to the show. Thanks, great to be here. Say welcome back because our viewers might recognize you from where? Well, we were at Brew Burger's Back Porch. Absolutely, and that's a huge brand, and we're going to get to that, but just before we do, let's talk about Chuck and L and the brand. Obviously, it's seafood. It is, it is, it is. It's seafood that you might not find elsewhere in town, I guess. Let's talk a little bit about the passion behind why Chuck and L and the name. Well, I guess Brew Burgers is my main concept, and it's pretty simple to understand what we do, so I tried to think of a seafood tie-in that would lend people to believe it was the same ownership, but also know what we do. Shuck and drink, basically. Absolutely. So if you saw our episode last week, we were at your other location of Brew Burgers, which you have two other locations, right? Or two locations. Two, yep, two Brew Burgers locations, sure. Amazing burgers, but so many people asked about seafood, and if there was anybody that knew food, obviously it would be you, right? That is it. That is it. Let's talk a little bit about what type of entrees you have here that our viewers can expect to find. Food line? Well, we have all kinds of stuff. We, we kind of base the menu on the whole coast of the Gulf. We have uh, low country boils from the Carolinas per se where you can get a mix and match of a lot of different seafood. We have some New Orleans specialties, jambalaya, uh, gumbo type of thing. We also have great uh, fried catfish or some handheld sandwiches. Um, all kinds of good stuff, actually. And speak about good stuff. You have a big bar here. Do you have a happy hour? Absolutely. From opening until 6 p.m. every day. Great. All right. If our viewers want to come, check this location out in person. What's the address? We are at 648 Tamiami Trail South on the island of Venice, right across from the hospital. Great. And some hours here. We are open on Wednesday through Sunday from 11 a.m. until 8 and maybe place a to-go order or get information. What's your phone number here? It is 941-499-7200. Last but not least, that website so our viewers can check out that menu all online. Shuckanale.com. Right there at the bottom of your screen. Listen, stay right there. When we come back, you know we're going to have to try it and tell you all about it when we return right after this message. Island Way Boutique, a women's boutique located in downtown Venice, also known as downtown's favorite store on the island. You can find many collections of clothes, including labels we all love and know. Beach cover-ups, dresses, tops, capris, purses, scarves. With so many accessories to choose from, we'll see you at Island Way Boutique, 225 West Miami Avenue, Venice. Welcome back. All right, guys, talk about seafood. This place has it for sure. All right, Michael, let's start right here. What are we trying here first? That right there is the Oshuk salad. We got an Arcadian spring mix lettuce underneath. It's got uh, toasted almonds. It's got fresh mango, and we make a crab salad that goes on top. It's delicious. I've never seen anything like this. Tell me the idea behind this. What was your choice, or what was your idea behind the, the image of this? Everything we do here, we try to do like coastal seafood, so we wanted to bring a little of the Caribbean in with the mangoes and just make it something different that you can't get anywhere else. I love that taste. The taste of that really comes together. I love that. Very, very nice. All right, your chance now. And you're going to love this because this is something you won't see anywhere else. But here at Shuck and Al, what's she going to be trying here? So that's one of our seafood boils. We kind of took an uh, image of a low country boil and we kind of jazzed it up a little bit and added some Caribbean spice and some other things. But it's got andouille sausage in there. It's got corn. It's got potatoes. That ha This particular one has a fried soft shell crab. We use a little cornmeal breading on there. And it also has shrimp in it. So there's a whole variety of them that you can order. But... Yeah, that, that's one of them. So it's All right, what'd you think? Delicious. I love the spice. Beautiful. Yes. All right. Speaking about spice, I think I know what this might be. That is, indeed. It's a chicken and sausage gumbo. gumbo. So, yep, it's uh, kind of a brown roux. We got the andouille sausage, chicken, rice, of course. You know what they say about gumbo? The only thing better is more gumbo. That's right. That's right. Mm. Oh, man. Wow, that is incredible. And I love the idea of having gumbo in, with seafood here. Yeah. 
Yeah, something different and something you don't get everywhere else. That's our whole idea is try to make it something a little different. All right, last but not least, what's she going to be trying next? That is our fried catfish po' boy. We batter it in-house or bread it. It's a light uh, breading. It has our homemade uh, French fries, Cajun fries on there, and a St. Armand's bun. It's to die for. Now, I know you got a big enough mouth to shove that in. Oh, gosh. <laughs> <laughs> and that bread, it's, I have it at the other location. I know it's absolutely amazing. So it's good stuff. Yep. Put it in. <laughs> <laughs> I love the combination, too, how you put so many different flavors of things in there. Yeah, it's got the homemade remoulade, which really adds a little something to it. It's got the pickles, garlic pickles on there. It's good stuff. So fresh, delicious. Love it. And what about that bread? Amazing. <laughs> All right, you know what else is amazing? The dessert, and it's up next. All right, you know what's my favorite part? Dessert! And dessert goes down right here. You can either have dessert right inside or you can take it out to the patio, and there's some magical things that happen at that patio, especially on the weekends, right? There are some very magic things that happen all over the place. But yes, the patio especially. We do live music out there. We have a great time. We do Friday and Saturday night music at this point. We're going to add uh, you know, some others throughout the week, but yeah, it's... Let's say we come into the restaurant, we say, wow, Tyler is right, that place will blow your mind, and you want to throw a party, or you want to do some outside catering, you offer that? Absolutely. Give us a shout, and we will come to your house. We can do a seafood boil if you want. We can even make the beignets. Whatever you want to do, we'll do it. Let's talk about these beignets. Tell me a little bit about them while we try them. So these are homemade, and if you don't know what a beignet is, well, you're missing out, first of all. Secondly, it's kind of like a French donut slash croissant, whatever you want to call it, but they're deep-fried deliciousness. All right, tell me about that sauce. That is a strawberry coulis sauce right there, homemade as well. Strawberry cooties? Yeah, no. <laughs> Let's go with strawberry sauce. It's oh, delicious. my God, I love that. That is really, really amazing that sweetness and it's really light so it's not like overpowering and neither are these beignets are very light very creamy very very good yep, great i'm glad you enjoy them. and what'd you think so flaky and that strawberry sauce you could taste all the notes amazing absolutely listen shuck and ale right here in venice if you haven't been there you're living underneath the rock come check it out that's the end of the segment we'll see you once again when we're out and about in venice out and about Venice made possible by these fine sponsors. This has been an Out and About Media Production and a product of the Catch Agency. Catch it. <laughs>